it's Pluto's turn to show off what he's learned in the two weeks. You know, they're both really sweet boys. You know, they have a little bit of different personalities, and that's the only reason that I don't recommend working them at the exact same time. You know, two puppies, it's going to take two handlers for now, or one person to go just a few, you know, um, houses, work one and then work the other one. Um, but I think they're both doing really well, so... Um, you know, make sure you're getting them out and working them about 10 minutes a day. It's not a big process, but you really need to go through these basics a little bit just to make sure that they're doing them for you. Um, you know, that doesn't mean they don't know them. It just means that we do have to follow it up. So we'll put them through their paces and show you what he's learned. Pluto, come on, go. Come on, let's go. Went a little further than I meant to. Stay. Again, up to about a minute, they should pull back. And you do need to go all the way, no, all the way back to their side before you release. Good boy, okay. Good job. Huh? Good, all right, let's go. Good, see it, let's go. Stay. No. You missed that and I missed the correction. So I'm going to go back and try that again. Come here. Come on, let's go. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Come on. Good. Stay. Talking is really good to do while you're doing some of this because when you want them to sit and stay is maybe when you meet somebody on the street and you want to say hello. So you do want to make sure that even if you're doing stays, maybe you're talking. I wouldn't be praising or talking to the dog, just a random conversation. Hey, I need to go to the school today and do some homework or something weird that just, it just, get a little voice in it. Okay. Good boy. Huh. Go. All right, let's go. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Good job. Let's go. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Good. Good boy. Go for a run. Let's go. Hurry. All right. Good boy. That was really good. Ready? Get it. Hurry. Pluto, come. Get it. Pluto, come. Ready? Get it. Pluto, come. Get it. Oops, I dropped, I, that one got attached to me. Let's try that again. Get it. Come. Hurry. Ha. If they start sniffing around or wandering around, just pull them back. No, come. Get it. Pluto, come. Get it. Come. Hurry, 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 hurry. But notice we're getting a lot of excitement, a lot of, no. Very little jumping. He tried. He knows he's not supposed to. 
kind of got his feet up and was like, oh, I'm not supposed to do that. Down. Down. They both do the kind of roll over thing. No. Down. Pluto, stay. It's just a puppy play thing. They roll over and they think, oh, you're going to pet my belly. And, you know, if the more they just learn that it's a down command, the better they'll get with it. They've got the stay part. They just need a little bit more on the down. No. Not allowed to get up until you release. Okay. Good job, buddy. When you greet a puppy, Really try to come around to the side and greet from here. You can push them into your leg. You can pop them down and off if they do want to get up and kind of get rowdy and that sort of thing. No. If they get too obnoxious, stand back up. Let them settle back down. Now, with two of them, it's going to be a lot. No. It's going to be a lot tougher, you know, as far as that goes. But just don't allow those jumps at all. No. Off. Good. They need to be taught anytime they come up, no off. Get back. You got your leash wrapped around your leg. Come here. No off. Oops. Fell over. See? Good. No off, 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 off. Sit. Good. So off is just one of those things that has to be worked from everybody's perspective. The biggest thing people make a mistake of is trying to push them away. And if you push on a dog, once you get your hands down, their focus goes to your hands and you can't get any kind of a correction. So you want to make sure your hands are up and that your feet and your body does all the language. Off. Good. And then when they're being good, turn into their side and give them all the lovings that they want. Ah, yeah, there's belly rubs too. All right. Good boy. Place. Pluto. Okay. Hurry. Place. Whoop. You missed it. You missed it. You missed it. You missed it. Here. There's that one. I know, huh? Down. Down. What I'd recommend when you have them in the house is to have both of them on leashes and maybe on separate ends of the couch um, when you're working downs and kind of getting them to calm down. And then as they calm down, you can kind of start bringing them together. But when they're together, they're so rowdy, I don't think you're going to be able to get the place or the lay down in the house right now together. Um, I think you'll have to work it kind of separately, um, but we'll kind of go over that a little bit when you pick them up. I think they're doing very well. You know, they've got a few more days to go. Um, as I said, we're not done. We're going to keep going, but I just wanted to put a little bit more up for you to show you where they finished up. I think they've done a wonderful job. So we'll see you guys when you get here next week. Hey.